Whoops. I picked the wrong password. A rare execution error. The first, like, two buttons I hit just didn't show up. How many matches do I have? I have almost... I have, like, 1,800, right? Last Cody's objective is to get a thousand, from my understanding, is to get a thousand wins before Strive comes out. He's got six days to get like 12 wins, right? So, you know, he's got some time. Cody, pick a damn song. There you go. Two DRC, two DRC, wild throw, yeah. Oh, I was waiting for him to do the thing so I could practice the combo I labbed the other day. That was an execution error. That's definitely not gonna work. Oh, I'm so dumb. Nice. This theme is pretty good. It's no disaster of passion, but... Oh, where's my DP? That doesn't work. I gotta do jump H, or that's never gonna work. Oh, God. Oh, that was not counter hit. Whoops, that was a 2D, not a 5D. He actually had so much momentum, oh god, that he just like carried past me. What's happening in this round? I'm almost stunned. Which is what he's trying to, oh god. There we go, that's how you do the clean hit. How am I down after the set? Did you defeat last Cody? You must defeat my vassals. <laughs> what was the score? Last Cody got hands, right? Last Cody got hands. Last Cody got hands. People don't understand. Oh, I DP. Did I? Uh, yeah, I've watched Invincible. I think Invincible is great. I highly recommend it. If you haven't seen it already, I would recommend it. That sucks. That didn't kill. Vertical Dolphin. Or that Dolphin. I'll take that trade. 3-1 in your favor, or in his favor, and then 30-3 to three in your favor. I got lucky, it sounds like. Oh, I got a 6P that. You know, that was my bad. Yeah, I was like, so sure about, oh, what? I didn't even match. I was like, so sure that my, um, my button was going to hit him that I didn't even think. I was like, I'll be fine. Yeah. That's what I tried to do last time and I missed it. That's unsafe, but I missed my punish. That didn't combo? I don't know why, but getting... Getting close slash to hit May when she's like air dashing at you like that is kind of hard. Oh, I six feet. And 
Nope. Don't stop wiggling. He's a wiggler. Ken what? Why is that Kenji person spamming so much? Hey, are you okay? Are those your only messages in the chat ever? Okay, I'm just gonna shoot shoot you for a little bit. You should think about your think about your life. You should think about your life. Take, take a minute and relax. I've determined that Mei is a demon that is... She has escaped from hell, and so you cannot grab her out of the air. Does that make sense? Oh my god. She is a, she is a demonic, demonous creature that is incapable of being air thrown. Oh, that was my bad. You ban Kenji? Who is that? Do you, do people know who that is, or is that just some random person named Kenji that posts random things? I don't know if that's... You got enough attention, I guess, for a day, right? Oh. I, oh, I almost comboed off it. I'm gonna wait for the next one. Nice. Oh, that hit my jump slash. That was so far away. Oh, I didn't run up wild throw. That was so far away. I cannot believe that six H hit me. I forgot. I'm s I'm so sad. I didn't get my run. I'll take that. Last Cody, he got he got like the tactics that are like guaranteed to hit you and make you feel like an idiot, you know? Like Oh, uh, I hate that that trades every time. It's such a bad trade for me cuz it does so much stun. Cody hits you with like the whiff 6H in a slide and you're like, what am I doing in my life? Unstoppable. It's like an unmovable object versus an unstoppable force. Oh God. I, br I broke the rules. Oh, whoops. The way I describe Last Cody's playstyle is, you know how in Yu-Gi-Oh every time tries every time everyone tries to win through depleting life points from zero to eight thousand. I would describe Last Cody as attempting to summon Exodia every game. You know, Deb, that's a good description. Last Cody is definitely an an average. You know, like people say, like. Average X enjoyer. He's like an average in Exodia enjoyer. I cannot believe I didn't stam block that. I ran up FD break and then I stam block. Well, I thought that was gonna hit. Oh, in hit stun. Were you mashing out of my stagger on something that wasn't even a stagger? Here it comes. Damn, nice. He did the shallow one. Ah, that was so bad. I missed my jump age, so I was like, fuck it, I'm wild throwing. That was a combo drop. Don't tell anybody. Where's my far slot? Damn, you're kind of looking like me now? What does that mean? Nope. The reactions of a of an uncaged mongoose. Oh. Oh, I almost whip punished that. Oh, I thought I was far enough back. I walked backwards to try to make that miss. I lab this. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Alright, maybe I'm not waiting. Okay, I stopped waiting. 
Nice. For the big, who is that? Wall Piggy, what up? Okay, well, I'm gonna just do this. Because I could win this. My 5k. I hate. I missed my combo. I hate souls of uh, jump K in this game. Jumping over the dolphin and hitting five, jump K and having it whiff feels so bad. For suited gamer, what up? Oh, my button. My Gatling. I'll take it. For the big, probably lurking. What up? full screen super because he's a May player. That was like the worst thing that could have happened right there too. That's unfortunate. Do Sidewinder loops scale badly after the third one? No, they like, uh, it depends on the character's life and how many times you hit them. He just summoned Exodia, yeah. The plan is like, you either win by normal means or he gets a gold burst and does a full screen super and it hits. I should probably lab how to punish that super, huh? Because a lot of his meter is spent uh, just doing, uh, I, did he drop the IK? I didn't even look at the screen. I honestly don't know. Most of his resources are spent doing supers that I don't know how to punish very well on block. And if I labbed both of them, I'd probably be in a much better gate, like, scenario, you know? Because I haven't labbed either one. Oh, it's so hard to air throw. I was plus three and hit a seven frame move and reversal dolphin hit. Wow, that was so high. Oh, that was 60. I'll take that. I didn't see what he got. I didn't look at the screen, to be honest. I just was like, you could have it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to mash out of, out of IK in casuals usually in this game because I don't want to ruin my poor hands. <laughs> if I'm dizzied, I'm just going to assume he's going to IK me. My hands will, my hands, I, you know, I can mash when I'm alive. When I'm supposed to be dead, I'm just going to give it to him. I'm just going to be like, yeah, you got me. I thought that was going to hit because he hit, what is that, slash? It's not a good trade for me, I don't think. Wow, you're a demon for that one. Oh, I threw it. Oh, you're definitely mashing out a stagger there. You're a sick fuck, Cody. No. Ah. Oh. I got stunned? What? I don't... How? Thanks for the 10 bits. Can you believe that? I don't even know what I got hit by. All right. Didn't I just get hit by like, I guess a super and that's it, right? The super and whatever the, the dolphin. You know, that's my favorite part about playing Last Cody is when you just know the dolphin's coming and you just DP it. It feels so good. Well, not what I meant to do, but I'll take it. I did run up throw OS and I got FD. I'm not sure how. I don't even know how I got stunned. <laughs> that was wild. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. I did forward plus, I guess I got down, down or something or back. So I don't know. 
Maybe I just did my OS too fast. Slide, I dare you. That'd be my 6P, huh? I try to air throw him. Oh, that was ambiguous. I thought he was going to go over me and do bonk. <laughs> no, I accidentally got two hits on my jump K. I can't make that combo against this character. Okay, let Shamu go. That's fine. Uh, you should always do an OS in this game when you're going to throw. Oh my god. So when you want to throw, you should run up and do, uh, what's it called? That was a throw OS, although I ended up getting the wrong thing. You should always do an OS to throw. I can, I can demonstrate after this match, maybe. Yeah, I forgot her 3K low profiles, my bar slash. Oh, that's not what I'm supposed to do. You just uh, hit another button when you're throwing. So just hit like forward plus H and then whatever your best attack is. So you can do kick slash dust, or not dust, uh, kick slash um, punch or uh, what's called heavy slash. If you want your 6H. Any button that's not dust. Six, you can do 6P, so if you want to throw OS with 6P, like, that's also fine. So I can I can run up and do it. That was with 6P. Me throw OSing with it. Or I can also throw OS with 5K so that C 5K came out when I try to throw. You can throw OS with it, whatever button you want to do. Damn the combo? I know I have to hit her low there, but I that was too low, I guess. Can you believe this boy's throw doesn't knock down in this game? His throw sucks in this game. Both his air throw and his ground throw, I think. I try to run under it. I can't stand that. His air throw is like I don't even know how else to describe it. It's just like, it's not very good. Or, uh, call it, what up? I guess maybe compared to other games, I should say. Oh God. This is looking like an Exodia round. On hit? Ooh, that was a good punish. Oh, I couldn't, I, I tried to jump back too. I might still lose this round. Super, yeah. We lab that. <coughs> we lab that. The full screen super is the May player classic. If you've never fought a May player, you may not know. But the full screen whale super is a is a May player staple. It's honestly mandatory. That's not gonna work. But it's okay, I got enough damage off of it. Yeah, 3k in neutral also, which is okay, because if you block it, they explode. You did it! You're a sick fuck, last Cody. You're just going to lie to everybody at home. 
That shit was 3k and you fucking know it. You're gonna take that shit to the grave? Roll! Why does Cody do it? Roll! It's roll! Fucking roll! It's roll! You donut! <laughs> uh, damn, he's good. Here it comes. Uh huh. I'm gonna lose this round. I can just tell. I can just tell this is not a good start. I'm already almost done. Oh, that's a double overhead? Says who? <gasps> Where's my. Oh no. I'm so fucking egregious. I've never been called egregious in my life. Do it. Ah! <laughs> ah. Ooh, I can play at that game too. See that block though? That block was kind of nice, right? Ah. Oh. <gasps> I DP don't wake up. Exodia. Exodia, my deck has no pathetic cards. What? Impossible. Slide. Ah. Oh. Damn it, I didn't think he was going to wake up throw. Oh, that'd be my 2D. Third raid duelist with a fourth raid deck. Impossible. Oh, I almost had it. Try to command throw me? But I was trying to command throw you. Draw your last pathetic card. Uh, impossible. That shit cracks me up every time. Yeah, they haven't said if there's IKs in the new game, yeah. Doom, doom, da doom, doom, doom. I feel like I have to play Disaster of Passion. Oh, I did throw, but I was still in whatever it's called. Up. You see that pin? I'm like the American sniper, you know? I mean, pinpoint accuracy. I was like, I know where he's going to be. A jump K? I thought for sure that was gonna finna be a jump 2H. Oh. I don't know why I try to air through that move a lot. Is that, isn't that her dust? Funk. Oh.
No! Damn it. I was trying so hard to get the stun the entire round. I just don't know how to IK. Fuck. I almost how the turns table. Damn. I tried so hard. I've never seen anybody mash that hard in my entire life. This motherfucker Cody was like sliding the stick across his head, you know, trying to get out of there. He says in the chat, not on me. <laughs> uh, uh, that shit's pretty good, I gotta say. I tried too. I set it up and I, I was like, this is perfect. I got my stun. Motherfucker said, not on me. He's gonna hit me with it now. I'm gonna get stunned for no reason by this character. Yeah, I'm doing viewer matches. I hate that. When it barely misses you, so you can't punish it. There we go. That's the height. Oh, no air throw? Fuck it. Send it. Send it. Oh, I did jump up to you. Oh. You know what's you know what's funny? I was like, he's gonna respect my DP on Waco. I'm chasing him. And he ran to the other side of the goddamn planet. Oh, it's too low. Give me the stun. Damn it, he died. Where's my stun? I jumped and did DP. Oh no, I'm gonna get stunned. She's the one who knocks. I don't know why I... Ch oh. I tried to 6P the anchor drop, but honestly, I should... Oh. What? I don't even know what that was. I don't was that the IK whiffing? I don't, I don't know. Not on me. For Neuro, what up? I honestly don't even know the input to do the IK. Isn't it, is it double quarter circle forward or is it one quarter circle forward H or S or is it S plus H? 236, 236 H? I thought it was S plus H. I don't even know the input. Okay, good to know. Word. Why don't she go the opposite direction? I tried to air throw her. It's impossible, I swear. She's a little demon, man. Ah. Fuck, it's so hard to mash out of that. I'm gonna... Dude. What's funny is... Last Cody is the demon of... Uh, what's it called? When you tech out, he hits you with 6H, right? That's his shit. I tried to air throw it again. Through your burst. I threw that shit. Oh, where's my button? That's not gonna work. Ah, I did DP and it didn't come out. How does he get stunned so he. I guess his character just stuns more than I do, right? Nice. 
Why is she that direction? Why is she going the opposite way? That's hard to chase, actually. Damn it. Oh. Oh. Her stun is her stun modifier is higher than souls. Does being a pirate just mean that it's harder to stun you? Is that how life works? How? How in the world is he not stunned? I'm going under. Oh, I went under part of the way. Yeah, uh huh? Despicable. <laughs> All it takes is one simple jump. Is Cody a bad player? I don't know. That 3k was so random. If it hit me, I would have died. He would have done 6h on me. And for no reason, I would have got hit because I'm an idiot. And then uh, I would have died. Put some respect. Last Cody was ranked 69 on the most wins in heaven leaderboard in the beta. Were you ranked 69? That's what I fucking thought. I cannot believe that didn't hit him actually. Fastest way to your destination is a straight line. ADP. I see. Oh god, I'm dead. I'm trying to 6P there because there was a gap. Hey, stop hurting me. Nice. Oh, you're approaching me? Me for rank 4 2069 myself hell yeah does last cody what stick does he use and does he have a lot of weeb shit on it so to get that ass bonked that's what you gotta do oh i thought i was so smart maybe i was Ow. Dude, the whiff recovery on that is, that is not at all what I try to do. The whiff recovery on that is like way faster than I expect. If that clashed, I would have returned this game. I would have messaged Steam and said, I need an emergency. I know it usually only two hours of playtime. I need to, this game to be out of my Steam. <laughs> list my library nah, maybe not a good bird oh my god why all my anti-airs lose with that button and my 2d didn't go under it huh all 
I should have I should have DP'd there instead of trying. I knew the sidewinder route wasn't gonna work, so I just didn't try it. I'm sad. You know. That was an accident. We take those though. <laughs> you take those. Oops. Ow. That's not a, a good trade for my vitality or my stun. Which honestly, my stun on. Oh, I don't know how to do that combo, but I'm pretty sure it works. Ah, it recovers so fast. Oh my god, I can't believe that reached me. I'm dead. Oh, that sucks. He could have just killed me off the 6H, right? He couldn't have just done Dolphin. How's it going? When is there going to be another will a kill? There was a will a kill a week ago. Which means sometime this month. Uh, there is the will of kill is the last last Friday in May. I usually do them once a month. You should go. You should make a will of kill. Is my advice to you. You should just try it and tell me tell me what your experience is like. Slap one together and just see see what it's like as uh, the person who creates it. I think you will realize why they are only once a month. That was good that he ended it early. There's a lot of reasons. One is sheer volume of work required to make it happen. Two, you want the people in the chat to have channel points to be able to spend. Uh, three, finding the clips, like finding that many clips is difficult, right? It is quite hard to find a lot of clips that work. So if you don't give it time, there's not gonna be any new clips in circulation and you need people to be able to go find the clips. And fourth, uh, you don't wanna burn it out. If there was a will it kill like every day, the series would very quickly lose its luster. You know what I mean? If you're watching Will It Kills every day, you'd be like, I'm very bored of this. It's not a series that can be done every week. I missed my uh, confirm. I don't know how I can talk like this while playing. I'll tell you what, while streaming, I play at least 25% worse than I do off stream. That's just the nature of, like talking while playing is very difficult. So I play way, way better when I'm not streaming because my mind is not focused on streaming and talking and like, you know, hanging out with you guys. Like my brain is like much less being dragged in a bunch of different places. Damn, he's good. I play at least like 20, 30% better off stream at minimum. The streamer's option select, you should try. I encourage you to try streaming and talking about the game while you play. You should try. If you don't believe me, try. Yeah, that was fun. That was a good set. 200 MS uh, May player, yeah. You should give it a go. I prompt you just turn on a recording and talk while you play. Just try it. Yeah, it's cool. <clears throat> Demon, I just get the question a lot. Oh, you know, Lament, you may make fun of Cody's combos, but he should make fun of your internet. I can't see. Yeah, I can't play this. <laughs> I can't, I can't play this. Like halfway through the block string, your moves, your move disappeared, and then I thought it was command throw because obviously, like, you know, oh god, because I was like, oh, she's probably running at me. That's probably what this is. And then the sweep into dolphin appeared, and I was like, oh, okay. I don't know where you're from, but 
the ping is too high and uh, the connection's too unstable. Yeah, I mean, come on. Is he from Australia? I don't know. That would make sense. Yeah, I didn't lose my meter. I'll take that. Yeah, the UK. Yeah, this is no good. No good. Scram. Oh my god, 234 MS. What's happening? And it's justice? Oh my god. What have I done? Is ducking? Question mark, exclamation mark. Ducking who? I played Lament before, and it's the same. Th it was the same thing last time. The connection is unplayable. It's too far. Which I normally in other rollback games, the UK is already hard from SoCal anyway. But this is like, you know, it's like, uh, it's like even worse because uh, the connection is like very, the connection is very unstable. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. Rollback is great when you're playing someone on the same planet as you that has a stable connection. But uh, if you don't meet those requirements, it turns out that it's bad, yes. Another thing to consider when it comes to this is I set my delay frames to one, right? So. For me, playing up to about 150 MS, which is all of my country and a lot of the countries nearby, I can play no problem. But if you're further than that, that's where we start to have some issues. Does that make sense? So it's possible. I don't know how to combo this character. It's possible to play people who are even further than what I just said, but uh, you know, you have to turn up your delay, and I always play on one frame. If you play on two frame, if you play on two frame, then uh, you can play people who are further away a little easier. But I play on one frame, so I don't know how to combo this character. I delayed it too much. Damn, he's good. Sending it. It was sent. I will play one more. Exactly one more. Justice Lightweight? Yeah, I think that sounds right. Good old Gold Burst really saved the day there, huh? Nice. Not too far. Whoops, that was Sidewinder. Wow, that didn't combo. I'm shocked, actually.
challenge, huh? I try to throw. Maybe Lamont. It's a far, far distance. All right, GG's. GG's big fan. Cowpunk 2077. This is uh, SoCal to um, East Coast Canada. Oh, I should pick a better song. It's too late, though. Nearly 4K games. What is that, Deb? I only have... 2800, 2900. Dev has way more games than the last time I played against her. Nice. One of the major things about this matchup is to anti air this character, you have to be very preemptive. Oh, fuck. It's hard. That's a. I didn't give what I wanted there. Wow, that doesn't low profile jump H, huh? So the main thing I can do in this matchup is uh is what's it called? No gun blaze, huh? Use gun flame from far away to beat the uh that was a BT. Use gun blaze to from far away to beat the oh we take those. Use Gunflame from far away to beat the like short hops. And then up close, you hunker down and then you wait right here and then you 2H. That's kind of the plan. Because you don't, you don't really have another plan. I don't really know. I guess I have to mash on those. I'm not really... I don't really have that much Hoss experience. Only a bit. That's plus. Oh, the Gunblaze. Whoa. Gunblaze hits uh Gunblaze hits that high vertically that jump slash after tech into slash hits me, huh? Okay. Stagger mashing worse than danger time. You just gotta get used to it. The problem is to stagger mash correctly you have to know the move you need to mash out of and uh, when they do it in combos. So you have to be aware of the, the matchup to do it correctly. It's not something that you can very easily uh, do without prior matchup knowledge from the character. That's exactly what I wanted. It just unfortunate. Oh, I can't challenge them. I knew it, and my button didn't autocorrect. That's okay. I dropped the combo anyway. Oh, no FRC. I don't really understand. I don't really understand how to beat that pressure very well. I think if I, I beat it, I, I thought I could throw, but I guess not. I have 6P. Wow, that's so fast. The problem is that Haas is so fast that you ha you have to be preemptive to keep this character out. You can't you can't really react 
to do it. Oh, I should I be. Sending it. I'm sending it. Oh. I DP'd when I landed. The corner position made this combo kind of suck. Yeah, my height was not right because of where the corner was. Oh, I hit 5k and it didn't even come out. Yeah, the problem, the problem with this matchup is that to AA this character or stop the approach, Soul has to be super preemptive. You can't, you can't really reaction deal with the jump very well, right? The jump arc is so low and the jump age is so big that you kind of have to preemptively commit to an AA option, which means that I, uh, I sort of have to just guess constantly in a in an unfavorable way about how Haas is gonna approach. Okay, well now I can do that. Wow, that would beat the recovery, huh? Whoops, that's not what I wanted. No FRC. I needed the FRC there so that I could uh, run under and then anti-air. It also, in the mid-range like that, if you jump over Soul's buttons, then uh, you're in a pretty good position. See, that's what I need to be able to do, but even then, I didn't get an anti-air. I think I could have shaken out of that. I'm not sure. I think that's what I have to do probably to deal with it. But this matchup is very like, uh, yeah, it's it's very like you have to know consistent responses to the answers or I think you just die. I think also to anti-air, I either need to use 2H or air throw. Because I don't think I can beat the, uh, the air approach without it. Like I think I kind of have to do that or I'm sort of in trouble. And then, oh god, if I hit a grounded button and I'm committed to that and then there's no jump, I'm dead, right? So. Is that plus? Yeah. Also, the, the thing is there too is that Haas's 2S has a much better, it has much better reward, right? As a poke because you can cancel it into rocket, which is plus on block. attempt that and the jump age stunned me instead <laughs> yeah I don't really have to, is enough matchup experience to shut down the options yet I need a little bit more time I think I should use more 2s even though the rewards bad I think it's better because yeah see how I was able to block that I think if I don't do 2s i'm not gonna be able to block that if i do far slash oh i counter hit my 5k oh i tried to tech fd not that no uh, no frc just means i'm stunned and dead here probably right Oh, 
Oh, I landed and hit 5k, and I think I was still airborne, so I didn't get it. Oh, that wasn't a backdash. That was a 2-8. Okay, well, that'd be 2-H. That's not gonna work. Oh, no combo? Nice. I tried to burst when the button hit me so that it didn't whiff. Yeah, 2S seems like a better option, right? I think more more of the rounds in the mid-range there, the 2S, uh, why did it OTG like that? Too many hits. The uh, 2S, I think it seems like a better option because it allows me to recover and then actually answer instead, instead of far slash, which has such long recovery that like if I challenge, I'm going to get punished when I land. See that? I couldn't have done that if if it was uh, far slash. Yeah, 2S seems better. Accident. Man. It really is a whole adventure out there trying to anti-arrow this character, huh? Every single t air exchange there, I try to A and you just can't do it. The problem is too is that Haas has the same normals, but a better a better kit to con control horizontal space. If you IB 6k, can you not challenge after? What is uh, 6k if you IB it? Every time I do, I keep trying to like DP. Maybe there's just not a gap there. I, I probably can, I would assume. This is the most gorilla round I've seen yet. I have bad news for you. I don't think you understand fighting games. Which is unfortunate. I think once you do, you could appreciate that there's a lot of cool decision making that has to be made when fighting a character like this. I thought that was going to be GP. Nice. What I mean by that is like because of there is uh because the character is so fast and controls grounded space so well, it forces me to have to use norm different normals and projectiles than I would normally would to keep the character out because uh Nice, good idea in challenge. I gotta start using jump H there. Yeah, I'm talking too much. Like, so what I mean by this is, in this matchup, I cannot stand on the ground in anti-air, right? It just doesn't work. So, and I cannot hit far slash because far slash recovers so slow that if 
Hoss is in the air, it's an instant punish every time. So I have to use 2S, and then when 2S recovers, I can try air throwing or, you know, anti-airing with something else. But you can't do it in that way. And if Hoss is far away using his 2S, I can use Gunflame on the ground like that, see, to anti-air the character. And then in my pressure right there, did you notice that... Deb, I beat the first hit of my jump in, but not the second. And you know why that happened? Because in the last sequence, Deb, I beat my jump slash because I did jump slash and then I went for wild throws. So she challenged. This time I did jump H, so she couldn't get the IB on the second hit. And then I could continue my pressure like normal. But if you don't have a brain, you can just type, oh, bungo bungo round instead of trying to learn a fighting game. You know, I, I just, I encourage you to think more instead of just, uh, instead of just like, Haha, ha, unga go bunga. Like, if you don't want to, that's fine, but. I, you shouldn't type in the chat, you know, that'd be great. Damn, I thought that was gonna be far enough away to escape. Ooh, that's so plus. Oh, I did the same thing. Oh, no, I thought like Right, so th that's what I'm saying. Like, you know, there's a lot of interesting decisions that happen every round that you just don't see, and you're like, haha, character go jump. You know, important to think about. I do not know how to fight the character very well, right? So my, uh, what's it called? My uh, experience here is not about trying to win. It's about trying to learn what I'm supposed to do in the matchup, because I don't really know it very well. It's not a matchup I've, I've played basically at all. All right, now the jump's coming. Yeah, huh? Yeah. That was good. Soul 5K is weak to crouch normals like that normally. I think I have to air throw there, maybe. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Nice. I did 2D there, and it just didn't reach. First save, wow. That is so bad. I really don't know what I'm supposed to do about uh, the range where Haas does jump H, like, and I want to throw gun flame or whatever. I really don't know what my answer is. Like, I, if I run forward, I don't make it under the character in a way that allows me to AA, and if I if I jump and try to like preemptively air throw, it makes my pressure so weak. Whoops. Yeah. See that time the double I beam? Oh, I thought I was gonna go by. I also didn't mean to do that jump normal. Scared of Fafner. All right. Oh, I try to air throw. Huh. 
My jump H didn't hit. That is really hard to ant here. <laughs> Even if you are ready for it. Oh, that's plus. That's interesting. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I did run into wild throw and I didn't get the run. But yeah, you can, you, I mean, so if your opponent's defense is, uh, adaptable like this it's much easier to run offense that's a little bit um a little bit trickier because you know that they're considering your options pretty well right for man before time so you see like devs trying to double ib the jump h now i can just uh, oh i did the same thing i can just do that right that's too low i think Nice. I tried to air throw the tech. Dev tech later. So I wasn't able to. I'm doing it. Here comes the jump. Oh. I don't know if Gunblaze is plus or not, actually. Presty boys, Zach, man, before time, what up? That was supposed to be 2H. I also have Far Slash there. Dude, it's like you have to use every brain cell mankind has ever used to try and stop this character from jumping at you. It is like a monumental effort. Oh no. I was supposed to be 5 8. Oh, I shouldn't have FD'd. Gunblaze is a good option there because if you. If you um, FD to avoid chip, Gunblaze is a real cross-up. Does that make sense? So if uh, you don't FD, Gunblaze is not real, right? You don't actually have to block a cross-up. But when you FD, it actually makes it so that you have to block a cross-up. Yeah, don't FD Gunblaze. Yeah, I, I hope you heard what I just said and didn't just type that in the chat. But yes, that is, that is correct. You should not FD Gunblaze, uh, generally. Usually when you're FDing Gunblaze, it's because you don't want to, and you're in a situation like I just described, where you're trying to avoid chip. That, that is why I FD'd Gunblaze. I hope that was clear by my explanation, but if not... Oh, no, FRC. If not, yeah, if that was supposed to be advice for the chat, then yes, you're right. If you're talking to me, then uh, please don't talk to me. Nice. That was good. The neutral jump was really good because I expected a forward jump. Oh, that was an air throw attempt. Mm, I tried to... Oh, my TD lost there after the trade. I'm pretty sure it was Haas far slash versus my... I think it was Hoss Far Slash versus my 5H, and then I 2D'd after, and 2, 2S beat my 2D. That's pretty wild. I didn't expect that. 
I thought for sure like the trade would be favorable to me because I did such a heavy button. You can grab gun blaze? No, not once it's traveling. I'll hold that. Well, if you were talking to me, then yeah, you should hold that. But if you're talking to the chat, that's your option select. Like, just say, oh, I was talking to the chat. Ha ha, smile. And then I won't be mad. But if you're talking to me, then yeah, you don't have ears. Which, you know, fair enough. Oh, I also tried to do that. Because I literally said out loud, like, yeah, right there, I was looking to beat Chip, which is why I have deed. Oh, whoops, I should have just done 2D like that. Why does it feel like Haas has such a better time anti-airing Soul than Soul does anti-airing Haas? That's so weird. Oh, really? I wanted to frame trap because last time there was a challenge there. Maybe I should have done far slash instead. Nice. Damn. Yeah, why does it feel like... Why does 5H feel like it's such a better anti-air for Soul's jump than... <laughs> than Soul's anti-airs are for Haas? I guess you kind of have to... I guess you kind of have to air throw. It's really the only way to beat jump H, I think. I don't know if you have another consistent option, honestly. Five H does have a good hitbox, and not only that, but it uh, it has pretty good reward also, right? Which is nice. Oh, it does low profile. I didn't know that Souls Two H low profile that. I thought it didn't for some reason. Or Two D. I'll be my 2 I also hit 5 H. I also hit 5 H. <laughs> this isn't going to kill. Or is it? Oh, that doesn't work, huh? I thought it killed. I guess I'm supposed to do jump back there. Whoops, that was not jump D, that was 2D. Oh, that was an accident too. That sucks. Mm. This is a really hard combo to burst, actually. Yeah, I'm just going to burst out of that. God, this character is so fast and hard to keep out. It's like so miserable. It's such a hard, uh, hard uh, task. All right, I'm gonna stretch my hands after this one. Eh. I have to, I have to look at that jump H. I don't really don't know how else to stop it, honestly. It feels like the neutral is so uh, lopsided in terms of uh, reward. Oh god. Eh, I don't know why I try to anti it. That's plus. That is also plus. Yeah. Yeah, jump E and jump H are both good jump buttons. I 
don't know what else to do there. Uh, jump H was my best idea. Or, sorry, 2H was my best idea. Oh, that sucks. I guess air throw really is the only one. Oh, I tried. <laughs> I tried to air throw it. Oh, no clean hit. I didn't mean to back that. Just gonna do this. Oh. That was FB Fafner. That sucks. I think it would have hit actually too. Alright, GG's. I really don't know what to do off of uh when jump H is coming out at you there. I thought two H was an okay answer, but I don't think so. Okay. Let's try this. Yeah, there's a lot of little decisions that you have to make. I think uh, it's harder for Soul than Haas. If the, the neutral feels miserable in the sense that, like, he's very fast and his grounded... The way he controls horizontal space is much better than Soul, yeah? Because he has Rocket. <clears throat> That's the biggest one. Rocket is such an advantageous thing. Plus, his sweep is plus, right? So you have sweep into charge being plus. And then the other thing is that when it comes to air control... Soul is more mobile in the air, but it doesn't matter because uh, anti-airing Haas is much harder. Right? So, like, Soul has to... He has to be very preemptive in the matchup. Yeah, for sure. Because if you're not being preemptive, uh, then, you know, you can't keep the character out. And if you're being preemptive, then Soul, Haas just does this. And the rocket. And then does this. Right? So that's that's, like, the problem. You're dealing with this, and then you're just like, please help. This, this alone, I think, makes the matchup feel much worse. Because Soul doesn't have something as good as Rocket to contest horizontal space. Which you need to do against Haas, otherwise he just runs at you, right? For Anxious. And then this, obviously, is a war crime. That comboed. So yeah, I think I, think I honestly... I think I kind of have to like even even pressure strings like this feel kind of bad against the character. I think I think I have to air throw it. 6P maybe maybe 6P will, it will be better. Although honestly, I feel like 6P is probably going to be very hard to react. Yeah, it's going to be very hard to react to in like an actual situation. At least the nice thing about air throw is that worst case scenario, if I'm trying to air throw, I'll get jump block. Yeah, like that, which is probably like a bit better for me than. It's probably a bit better for me than trying to contest it on the ground because I'll get jump block, which is like, you know, that's okay. Why not Volcanic Viper? It's hard to, I don't know if you play much gear <clears throat> or games like this, right? But anti-air DPs in games like this are traditionally very difficult. Uh, in fact, even reacting to a move like this with a 3-frame normal to AA is like, you know, you still got to be quick for that to maybe even work. So to pump and then do a DP is usually pretty hard. And also, this can happen where, like, whoops, where the character will go over you. I guess maybe he's a bad example. But, like, the character will go over you or... What happens if he just does like a farther jump and then the character goes past you and you miss or whatever? Like DPing an, an anti-air as an anti-air in games like this are usually only for specific things. Yeah, I think honestly, Dev, while I was playing, that's the one thing. There's two things I realized. One, I can't hit this button because if for any reason Haas is in the air, I'd die. 2S is just faster and it allows me to try to air throw in time and to just air throw like that. It's just the matchup is, is just that way. Rocket is like... Exert Fafner, but like wilder. You know, Rocket is like, well, maybe it's not as wild as Exert Fafner. It's like the the glue that this this version of Soul is missing. Yeah, he doesn't have Rocket. Rocket is like his version of Fafner, that is just it, it accomplishes his neutral gap and fills it very nicely with a good big check. You know, <clears throat> it's like the big check to keep you honest in this range. 
right right outside right where his jump arc starts to get scary right where his run is a threat it's very similar rocket is just like this quick fast advancing thing that's very scary to deal with not having a move like rocket is for sure like yeah or exert fafner or strive fafner you can definitely feel the uh what's it called you can definitely feel the weakness in that little gap on the screen there 